What's up friends of the good mood, this is Money and welcome to this wonderful Sunday playing some free for all in War Robots with probably one of the most overpowered setups in the entire game. To be honest, I'm not even sure if this is more overpowered than the Angler is. <laughs> Let's find out together ladies and gentlemen and also don't forget, this is the last opportunity for the 400,000 subs giveaway with the 400, um, uh, you know, Schütze Robots as a collector's edition item. In the top right corner you find the giveaway. Now in today's video we have Nessa, Nessa Riggs on our Raven. <laughs> yeah, it's an old robot um, uh, with uh, gets stealth every time he jumps now with the new uh, laser weapons with 800 meters range, double nuclear amp, and uh, you see you get 5 seconds stealth um, every time you uh, you use that jump. And then we have uh, various other skills, so this is really, 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 really insane. And uh, yeah, so let's go and have some fun in free for all and completely <laughs> obliterate the entire enemy team here. Um, we're already beginning with a quick kill against the shell robot who thought, uh, you know, he might be able to have a chance here against this setup. And then I spot a kill over there, but oh, unfortunately I didn't quite get that. That was unlucky because I do so much damage that technically I probably should have gotten that kill as well. Now we have this guy here with his last stand and his weapons, um, uh, his, his short range power brawler weapons. So I'm just gonna use a face shift for his last stand and then pop kill number three and I can came out of this with pretty much zero damage taken. Now, we're still in the game and you've seen the intro here, so you know we're going to be in the game for a little while. Let's go and get this kill, pop my kill, this guy goes into a stealth, behind me I'm getting attacked, I'm jumping up here, and uh, okay, where am I gonna land, oh, okay, I was lucky I was landed on the bridge and not in the abyss. Uh, Scorpion jumps on me, I expected it because I already felt his attack before and I know where he ended up, he's right behind that little column there and uh, it's just everybody who has the unfortunate, um, you know, the unfortunate time to meet me meets his death instantly. The damage output, let's be clear about this, the damage output from these laser weapons is absolutely overkill. If you ask me, these weapons perform like one of the most powerful brawler weapons in the game, but they do that at up, up to 800 meters range. There is no arguing, in my opinion, here. these weapons are hopelessly overpowered. The damage the enemy takes is the same in short range as it is in long range, and uh, and yeah, I mean, this is the situation from the intro. This guy goes down, he had half HP, he's gone down in one, age, in one second. This guy, he was almost full. One and a half seconds, he's killed. This guy, pop, 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 I open fire three times. Look how the fast, continuous recharge of these weapons were always it's not even no they don't even recharge they have zero recharge because they have unlimited ammo they only overheat as you fire uh, I don't know man these weapons are it's not even fun it's fu funny because they, they are just way too powerful uh, that is an uh, a mender right there who almost lost his entire mender and their mender is not really an easy to kill robot it's quite tanky actually and uh, and we almost dropped him and he just decided to go somewhere else because clearly he didn't have a chance trying to get that kill pop my kill yep and firing at the mender for another second here oh a titan has spawned in all right lo lo let's activate another stealth get that kill real quick okay he had a face shift lucky for him or maybe it was an angler and the mender down here, despite his healing and resistance, didn't stand a chance. However, the cataclysm guy somehow got the kill. Yeah, whatever, bro. Um, anyways, um, I think uh, it's uh, it's fair to say these weapons are overperforming by like three times as much as they should be, given that they uh, have this range option and can do this much at short range. Uh, as well as long range. Look at this, I, I'm already missing one of my medium, no, one of my light weapons I was missing. And I still t killed him, uh, that was a Capri in like a few seconds. Crazy. Anyways, ladies and gentlemen, if you like the content, you haven't yet subscribed to the channel, you like the video, uh, you know, quality, you like the, <laughs> uh, the commentary, whatever, uh, consider giving it a subscription, because uh, I would really love to have you guys on board for the next videos as well. Because there is, in fact, a giveaway also just around the corner. Um, uh, when this one ends with the 400 subs and the 400 collector's edition robots, they will immediately start a new new giveaway. Um, and I'm sure it's one that you don't want to miss out, so yeah, stay tuned uh, if you do enjoy the content in general. So, I'm jumping up here like, every time activating stealth. I'm making it a little difficult for these guys to kill me because obviously you can see these guys want me because I'm the small robot, the easy kill they think. Uh, but um, yeah, I'm just gonna just n maneuver, I'm out maneuvering them. And eventually, as long as I just enter stealth and stuff, they will fight each other. 
they're going to eventually fight each other. And when that happens, I'm the one who gets the sweet kills. So he's getting a shot from behind here, this guy, but he's really, really content with me. However, he's losing his Arthur in the process because, you know, I'm just waiting it out here. And, uh, and then my plan is to, of course, because it's free fall, is to just get the kill. So here I'm coming in from behind and, ah, didn't get the kill. How is that possible? <laughs> Freaking retaliator weapons got the kill. But now he used his ability and I can drop him. And I think that was not a fully maxed Mender. Because a full ma- no, not Mender. Um, uh, what's it called here? Uh, Minox. Minos. Uh, if it wasn't a full Minos, it, I, I- Ooh. The de okay, okay, it was a delayed explosion damage. But 16 kills already first, no problem. Uh, he's gonna start to fly instantly, alright, we're gonna walk behind cover. Alright. He still can hit us a little bit with his rockets there, but I'm just gonna jump up over the cover here after. And uh, the thing is, uh, I, he I think he can, with one of his weapons he can actually hit me here. Yeah, but only one of his weapons can, the others can't. So, I have to uh, cool down the weapons, which works also in, um, as we are, uh, you know, uh, face shifted, so you can use the face shift to cool down your weapons and restart firing with full firepower. That uh, pff, that was a shell, by the way. Not a robot you can typically kill in a, in two seconds, but we can do it here again. The face shift against the same enemy with the same setup, zero chance for him. Twenty kills, twenty kills. Yeah, so, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully I was able to get you, make you, this video is only halfway over, but, um, there's gonna be another match where I show you this again, uh, but, um, I'm hoping I can make your Sunday a little more interesting here with this, um, so, yeah, tell me what you, what you're doing this Sunday, guys, I, I read your comments, as you know, and I may not respond to all of them, but I'm reading, um, most of them, I would say. Um, because I periodically check back every few hours, uh, and uh, yeah, what you doing this Sunday? <laughs> I'll, be, I'll be at home recording a lot of video content now. <laughs> the next three, four hours I'll be doing nothing other but recording videos, um, maybe even five hours, because I also have to design the thumbnails for them, I uh, have to find video titles and descriptions and tags and do all of that. Um, yeah, so that will take me the next five, six hours, uh, but uh, what's your plan? So, let me hear which crazy plans you have. Uh-ohs. Okay, so this is a very interesting situation, by the way, because we have a lot of anglers. This is a free-for-all match against total meta players. And those are not just normal anglers, those are the cruel anglers, the new ones that have a hitbox problem or whatever. For some reason, they only take poor, small portions of the damage they should be taken. But... Since they're anglers, they don't want to fight each other, because anglers are impossible to kill, so they hate fighting each other. And whenever there's a chance to fight something else, so, example given, me, uh, they're gonna immediately switch to me. Instantly. But I have stealth every f a few seconds, so they're gonna force to do something else in the meantime, right? And uh, here we go with the angler coming in. He had his ability used. And I'm gonna try and finish him off here. Pop! First kill. That was one of those strong anglers. Now I'm in stealth, so he can't get me. He's running down here, so what am I doing? I'm just gonna jump up here. <laughs> Bye, dude. So how is that stealth ability of yours, or that ability of yours, didn't really work quite as well, didn't it? That, that jump is such a good thing, man. There's another cruel angler. So it must be another player, because remember, these guys didn't get a kill. So they didn't have the, uh, the points to restore one of their robots. So unless they have literally two of those exact same anglers ha hanging around in their hangar, this is another player with yet another angler. That's, of course, built the same way with these claw jaw weapons and so on, right? But I'm not gonna complain about this, because, you know, they... they I am running a really overpowered setup myself here, and I'm even asking the question, what is more overpowered? This or the, uh, am I gonna get the, ah, uh, almost. Um, uh, this or the anglers uh, that are, you know, typically uh, ruining everybody's gaming experience. Um, in this case, the, the, the constant stealth, this legendary pilot bringing the raven back into the game. I mean, look at this guy. He was just right there with us, and he was just attacking us. Now he's out of his ra- Why did you teleport back, buddy? Why did you teleport back? <laughs> you- I think you would've gotten, uh, did he would- would've gotten a stealth possibly at the end of his ability? I'm not sure, maybe I would've killed him in his ability. But he thought teleporting back was a good idea? 
Let me tell you, man, it was not. It was <laughs> You ended up right in front of me. All right, so this guy, the angler even has a physical... Can anybody explain to me why the angler gets a physical shield? Are you really telling me in any way, shape, or form that angler needed a physical shield to be powerful? It's just one of those things, right? It's just one of those Pixonic things where, like, oh, let's make a uni um, completely universally overpowered super machine that's so overpowered um, that y there's no even no not even thinking about anything. You just walk at the enemy, you press a button, and they all die, right? This is the angler, pretty much in a nutshell. <laughs> it's the angler in a nutshell. Um, uh oh, am I gonna be able to get him here? Nah. I'm <laughs> Okay, this time it didn't work. And and then they think like, okay, mm, it's already so way overpowered. It's already completely upset in the game balance and the health of the game. Mm, let's give him a physical shield too, because why not, right? It's just a pixonic thing. It's just, I wish they would just be more considerate with things when they release stuff. But yeah, let's just go and uh, keep going. In this case here, I, I, I gotta say, I'm kind of happy because this is an old robot. It's an old robot that you now you see him. Now you can actually see this robot in the game again because they give it this legendary pilot. Um, and I really like this. Did I just use my airstrike and then jump out of my own shield? That was smart, Manny. Good job. Let's play this again. Replay a hero moment of the day. Activating my, my airstrike and then jumping out of it. Yeah. I enjoy the shield, enemy. Uh, he's not getting the shield, but a so uh, neither am I. <laughs> so, yeah. Uh, that was not exactly the best situation there. I'm hoping this guy needs to reload, and he does now. He's reloading now, so I should be able to with massive fire- Of course, no. 99% firepower coming from me. 1% firepower coming from the enemy angler. His 1% trigger the kill. Yeah, uh, okay, okay, sure. And then he gets taken out by a scorpion. Hmm. Leaving me dry of kills that I deserved to get. Both of the- Now, actually, wait a minute. That Capri, I guess, you could argue it was his kill because he did definitely more damage. Also, it's interesting that a scorpion- that typically is really dangerous. You can counter him with a raven because you can just jump on him, right? Try to do that with a slow robot. <laughs> You're never gonna catch the scorpion, man. But you can't catch him with, um, yeah, with a with a raven because the raven just jumps and crosses cover, terrain, and distance and whatever. It's so good. All right, so now it's the time when the titans are spawning in, obviously. Uh, pretty obvious that the Titan has be has appeared on the battlefield. There's four of them now. I found the only robot that was not a Titan and killed it. Uh, and now I'm guessing the last guy also is a Titan. And now it's about trying to get. Oh, there's a Seraph. Um, and now I think it's 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 going to be difficult to snatch to snatch the kills. Uh, except this guy who lands really really weird. Uh, maybe perhaps I can get this one up there. Come on, legs, work please. Uh, oh yes, my kill. And this one. Ooh. Ah, uh, okay, that wasn't mine, but uh, you know, I'm first. Things are good. So things are good, and we can still ruin. Oh wait, that's a shell robot. He got the kill with a shell. Interesting, dude. All right, so let's hop into another uh, another raven, and uh, here comes a shell, uh, something with. Um ah no, they were attacking each other. Yeah, and I can snatch the kill from this far away. Look at this, boots. Yep, my kill. To be honest, I think I was the one who did all the damage there, so it definitely was deserved my kill. I don't know what the angler was doing, he was just hanging around his ability. Now this guy, ooh, putz, my kill as well. Ooh, wow, these rockets are just doing so much damage, it's crazy, man. These Sinister's claw, jaw, whatever. It doesn't matter if Sinister or not, they, they, they are just perfect accuracy, instant, like, so such good damage. Uh, output quick fix reload and then how long they fire and how much damage they do and then this rust effect that I'm not even sure what exactly it does now here you see I was just evading him for a while but look how fast he drops me man I was almost full there a second ago and now instantly I'm dropping down now he wants to use his weapons but um he realizes that I can always just jump away and I'm getting a third jump now <laughs> Every time triggering stealth, his ability is over, but my stealth is running, so he dies. It's so insane, man. This, this freaking... It's the perfect map in the perfect situation, because the initial question was, what's more overpowered, the angler or this thing? And it's really hard to tell, because I can actually just completely obliterate those... I mean, look, this is a Capri. He almost died completely from this. It, it, it is so insane. I mean, now he's healed back up, but... Um, now he's guy trying to hide behind cover, and I'm waiting for my chance 
to score the kill possibly. Let's see if it works. Jumping. And pop! My kill. Nice. Angler boy is still here. And remember, I already killed an angler before. And, and now we're here. What? Ooh. That was a long-lasting ability that he just had. Activating stealth, his ability was over. Look how fast he's getting grilled. Tell me that this isn't a brawling weapon. Did you... I mean, come on. Tell me this... Sorry, I, I, I jumped too far back. Uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I, I'm really sorry for this. Um, blah, 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 blah. So here. Tell me that this... We're just broke through his physical shield, by the way. Now, tell me this is not the damage output of a brawler weapon. It is! This is a full-fledged brawling weapon that brawls at 800 meters with perfect accuracy. It's not okay. It is not okay, man. This balancing is not okay. But yeah, so for now, ladies and gentlemen, hopefully again, you're having a wonderful Sunday. Don't forget the giveaway in the top right corner. Uh, it's the last chance tomorrow or the day after I'm going to be announcing the winners for it. So yeah, uh, and uh, yeah, see you in... Um, see you then. <laughs> Money signing off. Bye-bye.